Welcome back, you wonderful magic players out there. Uh, we're continuing our free-to-play adventures here. Uh, so today I wanted to create a deck, uh, start from scratch and see, uh, you know, how we can build up deck uh, using the strategy that I uh, th that I suggested earlier. Uh, wh what? Where did my quests go? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Anyways. Uh, we're going to create a uh, a black deck. That's what I want to create, and just as I suggested in my mono black uh, video, I'm going for uh, four divest. So we're going to create those. Uh, we're going for a kind of. Mm, Discard um, hand control kind of deck. Uh, we also want some burglar rats. Where are they? Here they are. My hero, the burglar rat. Is this a smaller bolas or is bowler just a bigger burglar rat? That's a. That's what I wonder. We of course want some cast downs uh, at some point, but uh, unfortunately, I think we need to spend our uh, uncommon rare cards on another great card. <laughs> Where is it? Plague mirror. Here it is. Some plague mirrors. Yes, thank you very much. I think these will. Uh, Come in handy, especially in the trenches. There's a lot of <laughs> one toughness creatures running around, and uh, you'll be digging through the trenches, <laughs> the bronze tier trenches with this deck. Uh, unfortunately, we are, of course, uh, forced to play with. Um, I'm going to spend my rare wild cards on lands that we uh, that we are not going to use uh, yet, uh, but at some point, I'm hoping to uh, splash a little bit of blue. Uh, to get both my favorite colors. Uh, black is my absolute favorite and blue would be my second favorite. So I want some, uh, you know, blue, black. Here they are, water grave. Feels good. Feels good to have some nice. Uh, we're also going to, since we have a mythic wild card here, let's have a look here. Actually, actually, how about a corn? How about a corn? Yeah, it's either corn, immortal sun. If we have a look at black here, what we can make out of our mythics, Phyrexian scriptures, which I actually like. Uh, and if we're going for a type of deck, I guess Borker could be really, really good. Uh, since we don't really care about our creatures in this type of deck. Uh, if we go for blue, black, there's not that much blue, black. There's nickel bolas, of course, uh, if we're building up to that. And, uh, but that's something I've already explored. I want to explore something different with this deck. So, I have mnemonic betrayal as well, uh, as an alternative, but it's a bit... Uh, works against some decks. I think it's a bit narrow. Uh, let's go for Phyrexian Scriptures and have an answer against those creature decks. Uh, and maybe at some point we can throw in some artifacts as well. Maybe. We'll see. Uh, yeah. So, let's filter what we got. <laughs> let's see what we have in this starter deck. Okay. So we could basically, I think, go for all the cheap cards that we get from the uh, starter deck. Uh, okay, the last cards then. Grave digger, I guess, and top it off with a rise from the grave. 
<laughs> Although this frog spirit uh, does look awesome, I think <laughs> I think no one has ever managed to get a hit in with that. Uh, no one in the history of magic. I think that's fine. I think that's about as good as it gets uh, with the starter deck. We don't need watery graves. <laughs> we don't have blue cards, so. Uh, we're going to save those for later. And we'll see what happens. See what happens with those. Yeah, I think it's a good curve. Mm, decent, uh, decent enough, I would say. Uh, done. Oh, we didn't name the deck. Excuse me. Uh, control. Discard. Discard the spell, yeah. It's a placeholder name. Uh, come up with something better at some point. Uh, but let's see. Here we have it. We have a discard deck. Let's see. Game delivers for us here. Antares. The Spanish. Spanish. Liliana Ress. Oh, okay, this this looks like an amazing hand. Double divest. Yes, please. Let's see what we're up against. Oh, it's the mirror matchup. It's the mirror matchup. Let's see. Let's see what we have got going there. Okay. So this is a bit of a pain to deal with. Uh, so I think this goes and the next one takes the grave digger. Yep. Holding up this <laughs> to speed up the game. <laughs> okay. Yep, that's about all the options we had available to him, I think. Uh, we don't need to play this now uh, since he probably doesn't have a three drop anyway, so we can play this out. Get a nice block down. And then we'll see. Flip to the center, that's fine. Okay, got a two two token. I think we're getting rid of that grave digger for now. Looks like the biggest threat that we're facing at the moment. Now we can just jump and maybe play our own grave digger to draw land. So the think tank, yep. Okay, so we got uh, murder. Let's see if this token gets brutally murdered. <laughs> the zombie token, let's see. Uh, no attacks. And step murder. <laughs> nope. Okay. Not getting murdered. The zombie won't get murdered. I think. Or. Is he considering murdering it? No. Uh, I don't think it matters that much. I think they're both zombies. Ooh, this is a really great card that we're facing right now. Will he murder this? <laughs> we'll see. Top versus Christ, <laughs> I realized right now. Can't be easy. Facing off Christ in your first matchup. Christ playing black, of course, for some reason. Not playing white, that would be too Jesus stereotypical. Uh, okay. Passing here. 
So, I mean, we can just pass, play in hired blade, or maybe even attack here. Let's see what it does. Okay, okay. Hired blade has flash. I played <laughs> black Star Trek enough to <laughs> remember that. Otherwise, I'm quite underutilized card, I say. Uh, yeah, we can just pass the turn. Uh, and before it's my turn, I'm going to hard blade. <laughs> Think my opponent is having nightmare flashbacks from the tutorial with only <laughs> flash creatures. Uh, Death Baron. Oh, we can attack first, we don't need to. These aren't zombies, so... I they got murdered. Brutally murdered. Yeah, we can just get this out. It's a 2-2 two -two for 3. That's fine. In free to play, that's fine. <laughs> when you're up against a starter deck, 2-2 two -two for 3 is a fine card. <laughs> okay. So a 3 for fire. Got the scriptures to deal with. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have the mana to deal with it. Uh, we can send in a death baron here and see if we get a use for the skull dugger. If the skull will be dugger. Dugger? Dugger? Skull dugger. Yeah, are you blocking? Okay. Uh, so, if I get you control for the future. Ooh. Didn't even need the scriptures here. Would be nice with a fourth swamp. <laughs> at some point, just saying, at some point would be nice. Okay, open the grave. But no creatures. Ooh, here it is. Okay. So, since he's already tapped out, he can do this main post. Uh, Hired Blade, Doom the Center. I think this card right here is pretty nice, even though we have the Death Baron. Uh, but we need to flip Doom the Center for so This is fine. Baron got murdered. Tragic, tragic end. Uh, we can attack first. And got a valid. A valid. And see what happens. If I remember the black. Deck. There's a big six drop of flyer, like a four four or a five five flyer for six seven. Uh, we didn't include it in this deck because it's a shit card. <laughs> we can't avoid it. Okay. Uh, yep. There's nothing. Unless he has spiced up his deck in some way. Which I don't think he has. Uh, let's have a look. Why not? I don't think he has a clutch. Clutch. <laughs> clutch hired blade there. Yep. Sending in the troops. Uh, do I want to kill this? Ah, he gets a 2-2 anyway, so nope, that's fine. Easy win. Scrub tier win. <laughs> the starter deck face off. The modified starter deck versus the non-modified starter deck. Not really a fair game, probably. Blue or red? Blue or red? Black or red? 
Okay. So. Okay, we can't switch these. Uh, ooh. Got some gold here. Uh, but I think we'll save that for the next video. And we're back. Time to spend that thousand gold. Get a pack. Boosh! Oof. What is it? What are we gonna get? <laughs> Not really a fan of that. Okay. Blue meter. Yeah, maybe when we're splashing blue, we'll get a use for the blue meter. I don't really like this card, but uh, I mean, as a placeholder until we get something better, this can definitely work. Uh, don't have the mana to support this yet, though. So. Wait a bit. A little bit. Uh, yeah, let's just jump into the next game. Uh, boosh. Oh, so messed up my recording a bit there. But we're back. That's fine. Uh, one drop, drop, two drop, three drop. Doesn't get better than that, I don't think. The ghoul. The ghoul is out. Mm. The ghoul is out. And. Okay, uh, so are there any two drops in the starter deck that we're afraid of? I don't think so. I think we can keep this and drop a Doom Descenter here, and then next turn uh, go for a Walking Corpse and a Dive Best. So I think there's no two drops. That'd be cool. There's a Mana Dork, of course, but shouldn't pose much of a problem with the Probably. Um, let's see where it goes for. Does he flip the dissenter or does he block the ghoul? That's the question. He's in the think tank. Big decisions here. Yep. Better spend our time here. <laughs> The scrub tier Einstein <laughs> thinking through those starter deck decisions. Flip it. That's good. Let's have a look at that hand. Okay. Centaur Corsair, we're not afraid of that. I actually think if he gets to that. Okay, but he has a rabbit bite here, so. To get rid of this, but on the other hand, we have a plague mirror, and he's probably going to block the two twos. So no, uh, golems. Golems, what I want. If he goes for the blocks here next turn. I can clear his board. I think that's what's going to happen. Let's see. Maybe he'll take six. Do the smart thing. And then he has this rabbit bite, but I think he's he will be too tempted to block at least with the Corsair. Because it kills. Ah, so creatures. Oops. He goes for the attack. Interesting, okay. So why is he throwing this away? He has no mana, so. Uh, we can attack here. Will he block? No. Oh, that's a smart, smart thing to do. I think we're saving this for next time. Yeah. Probably going to rabid bite one of our creatures, I think. And then maybe going for the beats. Would be my guess. Would be my guess. That's three two twos. Checking them out. They're all zombies. They're all two twos. But they have no other text. Oh, this comes in the first half. Yep. It's a beat down. Beat down guy. And a beat down mission. Uh, let's see. Could be any creatures. It might be relevant. No. 
still on the rabbit bite. It's a bit off playing this, so I think we'll save. We can present a lethal next turn. Yeah, even if it kills one of our creatures, that's fine. So one more time. Draw something, or is he? I don't think there's something. Yep. That's a very uninteresting game, I guess. But got some coins. Very keen for that. Soon about to complete one of the quests, at least. <laughs> Christ versus Gozu. <laughs> what a matchup. Who will win? Yep, this is a keep. One drop, two drop, three drop, three drop. Amazing curve. And three lands here. Securing our three drops. Our important three drops. Must add. Okay. On top zero bottom. That's so he mulliganed. What will be his play? It's a green one. Forest dweller. This artifact guy. Will there be three? Oh, is this the. Uh, oh. Red Queen starter deck. We've moved up. We got new opponents. You spice your opponents. Okay. Oops. Descent here. Let's see if he has a dinosaur to go with this. Oh no, no. Human Knight, I'm so bad cost two less. So I think he wants to cast a dinosaur. Question is, do we murder that knight? Or do we murder the dinosaur? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> in with both of these. Yeah, I think we're fine for now. I'm gonna death touch her down. Beat him down, and then we have can save the murder for the actual dinosaur. We'll get it at, at some point anyway, so I think this is fine. Is he going for blocks? Okay. Does he hate the death creature? <laughs> or didn't read the card? I don't know. I don't know. Worked out fine. <laughs> you scrub tears. <laughs> the weirdest of plays. Had a tendency to work out. Ooh. That's spicy. That's spicy. Okay. Yep. It's that one. Uh. Feels like I want to get rid of his, his last card in his hand right now. I don't know what it is. But I have, if he has a phoenix then... What was that? <laughs> okay, this guy is spicy. I don't think this is included in the... Not that what I remember. Um, mm, 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 mm. I don't want to attack with this guy. If we flip him, that's bad. So, will he block? Will he block? Yep. Yep. That's perfect. And we get our 2 2 and pass the turn. Okay, another 1 1. Phoenix, fortunately for us, is not a dinosaur. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. <laughs> so here comes the sweeps, I guess. Here comes the sweeps. Here comes the sweeps. And our opponent comes. <laughs> Opponent down at 12, so I don't think he can afford attacking with the Phoenix. Will he? Send the beat down. <laughs> he doesn't care about racing. <laughs> or actually, he does care about racing, that's the only thing he cares about. And maybe he doesn't care about winning. Or, is he. Top decking, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what he's playing into. Victory! Boosh! Against a non starter deck. At least he had fiddled a bit with the cards. So. <laughs> it's a little bit different. A little bit different. So, yeah, how about another? Soon about to get those 750 sweet coins. Sweet, sweet coins. Are you ready? Inui. Um, this looks fun. Three mana, a three drop, a four drop, a one drop. I think two drops though. We will, we will draw into one. Our opponent is deep in the think tank right now. He's thinking, considering the possibilities. I think it will be a basic land. Oh, okay. He's mulliganing. Then that's fine. Uh, we'll test one, and we're going to have a look. Mr. Inui's hand. Ooh, it's the blue, uh, green starter deck, and it only has one creature, so that goes away. It goes off to a bit of a slow start here. See if that favors anyone. Pondering, next land drop, and we're gonna mm, not play it out of plague. No, I think that the blue green deck has a lot of one drops, you can probably deal with something with the plague. No? We're not in a hurry here. Yep, that's fine. So should we wait? Yeah, we should probably wait until he plays this and get rid of the 1-1 one, one as well. Especially since we have this now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm fine passing here. Hope he plays this out, then we can... Uh, play the creature you control, right? We can't do that. Oh, we can do that. We can just play this first and discard it by Bury afterwards. Uh, okay. Gonna get another Merfolk. Enters the battlefield for three, okay. So, I think we're going to have to sweep it up. Uh, well, we could go for a higher blade, kill the deep root elite, and then go for another skull divery and a plague next on. That would be quite devastating, I think. Uh, should we do that in response to him playing it? Let's see, what is this? Ah, uh, let's do this. Yes, yes. Uh, and pass the turn. See what it plays? I think this. Yep. That guy's going down. Downtown! So we got the sweeps now. 
And with the skull dagger, we should be able to clear the board. Seems fine. Silver gym. Yep, we're not blocking that. That's <laughs> going to die anyway, so. My turn. Another plague mare, that's nice. Uh, let's play this first. Yep. Clear the board up a bit. And then let's buff the guy who's actually going to attack here to get some more damage. In. Bada beach. Boom bada beach bada boom bada beach. Turn target creature with bonus hand. What is that? Oh yeah, that's I think included in that deck. I don't think he has altered. Okay. Yes, he, no, he play, paid the full cost so he doesn't have another creature. Uh, we can just get rid of that with the Plague Mare, but do we...? Yeah, yeah, I think that's fine. Save the high blade, run for it and stuff. And just go for the deep downers. Camera's getting a bit dark, maybe. Let's yep. This looks better. Uh, that's a nice one. Now we got the beat downs. <laughs> this card looks a bit awkward. <laughs> uh, we don't have anything in the graveyard, so let's pass the turn. No plays from our opponent. Uh, do we put something into play here? Do we free to loot? No, we can just keep this. If we play something, we can tap something down. Next turn, and go for green. Anticipate. Put the top three cards. Seems like we got the win here. Oh. Yep. Seems like we win. Nope. <laughs> Not that card. <laughs> uh, the battle team. Battle creature. Yep. That's the only one. We can tap. And then boosh. Can lock one of them. But then he's dead. Boosh! The win. <laughs> In the trenches. Yes, 850 gold. Another pack. Another pack. Let's see if this pack brings another uncommon card uh, that we can make use of. What is this? Is graveyard or hand an exile it? Okay. Ooh! This is a nice card. At some point we might be... Oh, we probably won't be splashing green. <laughs> but we're making a green deck maybe. Uh, something for the quests that we're doing. Could be nice. Anyways, we got an uncommon card here, so... Sweet uncommon. I think the best uncommon we could go for is, uh, or at least my favorite uncommon. Whoops, not collected. Mm -mm -mm. Where is it? Where is it? Here it is. Eldest Reborn. I think our deck could really. Uh, be improved by this card. 
got a lot of discards, so I'm not fine keeping that in. So Grave Digger versus Rise from the Grave. Hmm. I think one Grave Digger, one Rise from the Grave is fine. Uh, keeping an Eldest Reborn, or maybe actually two Grave Diggers, drop one Swamp. We're very low curve, so we don't need 24 Swamps in this deck. And that would be it for now. Uh, so, we got some blue quests here and some red spell quests. I'm going to finish these uh, by myself because I'm <laughs> basically just going to create. I can show you how I do this. Uh, it's, a, it's a very simple process. I go to red and then I just select all the low costing cards in red. Okay. Yeah, that's uh, that's the exact red starter deck I think. <laughs> I didn't even have to do this. <laughs> Maybe I could. There's no other cards. Ooh, I got a fresh faced recruit. Okay. And what I'm going to do with this uh, is that I'm going to uh, just play a game, play out the cards, concede. <laughs> do do it one more time, uh, you know. Concede uh, until I get this uh, gold. So it's not that exciting to watch, <laughs> unfortunately. <laughs> so, uh, so you do what you have to do, you know, to get <laughs> to get your cards. Uh, but next time, I think uh, in two days or so, we're going to have some more quests, and let's continue and let's see if we can build this into a competitive deck at some point. Thank you for watching.